lo que es el espacio fuerte que le, que le, que le voy a traer esta semana. Ya. Eh, él, lo fuerte es su velocidad, su habilidad para defensiva también. ¿La velocidad cuánto la trabaja? ¿La última? ¿La última? ¿La, última? ¿La velocidad? Él empieza a trabajar velocidad ya cuando está en, en 155, 153 libras. Es cuando le a trabajar la velocidad. Ahorita estamos trabajando lo que es fuerza, extensión y más que todo este, este, ser más, este, más efectivo con el golpe. ¿La pelea es en 147? 147, cuenta. ¿Qué le van a decir a la gente? Pues más que todo que van, uh, van, a, van a mirar una buena pelea. Este, yo sé que últimamente el boxeo no les ha dado las peleas que ellos esperan mirar y por mi parte voy a, voy a esperar, este, vamos a preparar a Timothy Bradley, yo sé que Jesse se va a preparar también para darles una pelea en la cual este, la gente va a estar este, más que todo emocionada de mirar después de las peleas que, que han pasado que no, no les han gustado. Por la mejor cadena que se ha el 26 de junio. Claro que sí, en HBO, HBO les, va a dar una, les vamos a proponer una buena función de boxeo esa noche. That's the fight he wanted. He said he wanted a big name. He wants to you know, elevate himself to the next level. Were you ever train in Las Vegas yourself? Yep. Yeah. Do, do, yeah, do you prefer Las Vegas or where would you like to meet? Where would you? You said. Let us down over the few 
years, but this time you won't be let down. So tune in, have a great night. I want to thank uh, Jesse Vargas, uh, Roy Jones for, you know, just uh, when I share the ring together. You know, like uh, Roy said, these two guys are two professionals, uh, great fighters. You know, they both uh, learn to bring the best out of themselves that night. Uh, Tim Bradley wants to be a world champion again. He wants to be up there among the best and fight the best. Uh, Jesse Vargas is a, a world champion, undefeated, young, young prospect, um, great, talented kid, and he wants to be among the best. So, uh, all I can tell you guys is this: I know they're both uh, going to be in great shape. They got their mindset to win that fight. So, at the end of the night, people are going to walk out of there happy to see a great performance and a great fight. Thanks, everybody, and I invite everybody to come see. Tim Bradley and Jesse Vargas, June 27th. Thank you. I have him on my team, I have him on my side, and uh, he has a great game plan for me. I want to thank Tim, Timothy Bradley, Tim, uh, Team Bradley as well for the opportunity. Uh, I'm very happy to be here. Very, very happy. This is the opportunity that I've been waiting for for years. Ever since I was a kid, I, kid, I dreamed of this opportunity. It's here now, and I'm training very hard to come out victorious. June 27th. I know that it's, it's a tough task in front of me, but nothing's impossible. Uh, you know, I want to give a shout out to my friends in Las Vegas, uh, Clark County, and and you're gonna, you're gonna, ex I think everyone is expecting a great fight June 27th. We know that Timothy Bradley and myself always give, give it our all in, our, in the ring. We have the lion, the, the heart of a lion. I think we both do. That's why I have so much respect for Timothy. You know, I know that he always digs deep, but that night, June 27th, we're both going to have to be very big and, and we'll see who who, uh, who comes out with the victory. Expect a great fight. Thank you all for your support. Thanks, Bob, for those kind words. Um, first of all, I want to give a all honor and praise to God for allowing me to be here today, stand before everybody. I want to thank everybody that came out today to this press conference. Of course, I want to thank my team, Team Bradley. I want to thank my, my team outside, uh, my wife. Um, I'm gonna thank you so much for just being there supporting me and uh, dealing with my mess and how crazy I am. And as a fighter, man, it's no joke. Um, I wanna thank my brother, my brother-in-law, Chris, for uh, you know taking time out of his life to help me out on my journey. Um, wow, yeah, back again. I, I can't wait to get back in the ring. Um, I wanna thank HBO for bringing me back once again, man. I'm telling you, the Premier Network, HBO can't get any better than this. Um, did I miss anybody? Stub Hub, I want to thank the Stub Hub for bringing me back. 2013 was fight of the year. I think this fight might be a candidate for fight of the year. I'm already calling it right now. Um, a lot of a lot of you out there, you know, see this fight on paper and you guys are like, oh, you know, it's an easy fight for you, Bradley. And I'm like, y'all crazy. <laughs> what you mean easy fight for Bradley? This fight is not easy whatsoever. Every fight is a threat, especially a young fighter that's talented like Jesse Vargas. It's like, hey, I'm, I'm nervous because this is a kid, undefeated, world champion. And I was once undefeated, undefeated, and a world champion. And I had an opportunity of a lifetime to change my life drastically, you know, in one night. And I did that. So Jesse Vargas, he's looking to, to do the same thing. So I know it. I'm training hard. I'm training extremely hard. I'm training like if I'm training fighting, uh, you know, Manny Pacquiao or, or Marquez. I'm training just as hard, if not harder. And uh, I've gone back to my roots and what I what got me to this position. So I'm doing a lot of the training techniques that I used to do that I didn't do before, you know, that I stopped doing once I got on top. So I'm trying to get back on top. This is my opportunity. Um, you know, I just found out this morning, Bob just told me just now that I'm gonna be fighting for the WBO World Championship. So I have an opportunity to get my belt back. And I set out, I said that I was gonna get my belt back and I will get it back on June 27th. You know, I know I got a tough task ahead of me, but I'm preparing myself 150% for this, for this matchup against Jesse Vargas. But, um, you know, I wanna invite everybody to come on out. You know, I, I call stuff of the war ground. Because every time there's a fight there, there's always a war. And um, I think this fight's going to be a war. So uh, I want to thank Roy and, uh, you know, this team up here, man, Jesse Vargas. 
Um, you know, I've been a fan of Roars and Roy since I was started boxing. So it, it's, it's, it sucks and it's sad for me <laughs> to be going up against like a, a fighter that I admire. I, I'm serious. I admire Roy, man. And, and um, you know, I, I wanted to be like him as a kid. You know, I wanted to fight like him as, as I was a kid. So, you know, he was, he was one of my idols. So, you know, it, it sucks that he's on the other side, but it is what it is. Like he said, it's, it's business, no hard feelings. And it's all love at the end of the day. So thank you everybody for coming out and uh, stay tuned. June 27th. Don't don't miss it. Thank you. Fighters, uh, back up. Just a little bit please. Just a couple inches. Right there. Tim, come on up just a little. Tim, just a little. Right there. There we go. Yes, right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Hold it.